Welcome! This is Andy from Edelweiss Interactive and in this video I'm going to show you how clouds that were created using the cloud system may look in an actual application. The cloud system is based on particles. They are either rendered using Unity's particle system or a custom one. Unity's particle system has the advantage that it is mostly the fastest solution but has the drawback that the particles have to be squared and each particle can only be shaded using a single color. Our custom particle system on the other hand allows particles that are not squared and each vertex can be colored separately which gives clouds a smoother look. With the cloud system you can model any cloud shape you want using boxes. You can specify exactly what kind of particles have to be created in them. This cloud for instance was modeled using 8 boxes and contains 378 particles. You may enhance 2.5D games with clouds and only get a minimal performance impact. If neither the camera nor the cloud is rotated, the cloud system calculates the mesh once and from then on it will be rendered by Unity just like a usual mesh that is using a transparent shader. This cloud consists of 84 particles. The cloud you are seeing right now is my personal favorite. You can see that it contains quite some shading, but it is not a two-dimensional picture. It consists of 148 particles and is using four different particle images from the cloud texture. It is rendered with just one draw call. You may certainly create usual clouds. Flying through them gives you a nice in-cloud experience. This cloud consists of 272 particles. During the development we had a strong focus on the workflow for the cloud creation. It has a lot of parallels to 3D modeling. The first step in 3D modeling is to create the mesh. With the cloud system you create boxes to define the cloud shape. The next step for the 3D model is to unwrap and texture it. In the cloud system you specify which particle images or tiles from the cloud texture have to be used. By pressing a button the cloud creator automatically generates randomly placed particles. You may easily improve the look by tweaking all the settings or by adjusting single particles. Each of those six clouds consists of 313 particles. All of them are based on the same particle data and were modeled with two boxes only. The three clouds on the left hand side are using our custom renderer while the ones on the right hand side are using Unity's particle system. We apply effects to all of them. Effects can be used in a lot of different situations. Each shading and fading value that can be set in the editor may also be changed at runtime. You may use them to simulate changing weather conditions or changing time of day or a lot of other things. As you see you may also create unnatural looking clouds. The cloud system allows you to create any imaginable cloud that is using particles. All the scenes from this video are available on our webpage and all except for the LURPS tutorial are bundled with the cloud system. If you have any question about the cloud system feel free to ask them in the cloud system thread in the Unity forums. Thanks for watching.